Welcome to Cattails YouTube channel. Today's subject is 5 facts about female cats. We're going to discuss 5 facts about female cats today because there are some significant differences between males and females, some of which I bet you've never heard of. Did you know that subscribing to this channel, regardless of whether you have male or female cats truly helps this channel? If not, hit the subscribe button now. Fact number 1 Dominant Paws the next time you're eating something delicious and your female cat approaches and says I want a piece of that, check to see if she uses right paw or left paw. Did you know that female cat's dominant paw tends to be right paw which means they'll lead with their right paw when they walk, or they'll hunt first and foremost with their right paw, or they'll grab that last piece of chicken right out of your mouth with that right paw. Fact number 2 Coat Patterns Did you know that the majority of calicos, torties, and torbies are female? In fact, 99% of all tortai and calico cats are born female, and the 1% that are born male are born sterile and unable to pass the gene on, making them extremely uncommon. Remember that it requires two X chromosomes to create a male tortai, which is why they are so rare. Bonus fact related to coat patterns, spicy temperament. Here's the inside scoop on that color pattern. Tortitude or the idea that calicos and torties can be a little more, how shall we phrase this, spicy, you know what I mean torchalicious, is actually based on temperament truth or at least largely. One study found a connection between the torti and calico coat pattern, often known as the GG coat pattern, and particular tortoid-like behaviors. Those cats frequently exercise dominance and serve as the pack leaders. Fact number 3 Worshipped by Ancient Egyptians Ancient Egyptians considered cats to be deities, and they frequently mummified cats and placed them in the same tomb as their human owners. The Egyptians really did elevate cats to a certain level because cat mummies, like all animal offerings, were revered and required to be properly buried. Did you know, however, that the main point of emphasis for the Egyptian culture's deification of cats was a woman by the name of Bashtet? She was the goddess of protection. Fact number 4 True Queens Queens are female cats that have not been spayed. The term queens actually derives from the verb queening, which is the act of giving birth to cats. Cats are goddesses and queens, so it's appropriate that my next section of Did You Know Facts About Female Cats is all about pregnancy and giving birth. Fact number 5 Pregnancy, Hormones, Etc. Did you know that a female cat that has not been spayed can have her first litter as early as 3 to 4 months? This means that the adorable little kitten could become a mother. Did you know that, although there may be more, they typically have two litters a year with an average of four to six kittens in each litter? Did you know that the first litter typically has fewer kittens than subsequent ones and that the 1970 litter with the most recorded kittens had a total of 19? Crazy! Did you know that a female can become pregnant by multiple fathers during a single heat cycle? Did you know that an intact queen will eventually live a shorter life than a cat who has been spayed? This is entirely due to the constant hormonal fluctuations and pregnancies that can cause cancers like uterine and mammary cancers every time they go into heat, which increases the likelihood of developing those cancers later in life. This brings me to my main point, which is as long as you are not registered breeder working on pedigree cat standards there is absolutely no excuse for you not to spay your female cats. Spaying them as young as 12 weeks old is completely safe. It will keep them healthier and help them live longer lives. Conclusion Hopefully, there was one or two in there that you didn't know, you welcome to consider subscribing to Cat Tales for more amazing cat videos. Okay, until next time, everyone. Please keep the questions coming and let me know what you'd like to see in future videos. Best wishes and have a protastic time.